She's beautiful. What's her name? Marley. Her name was Marley. It's a beautiful name. Yeah, we named her after Bob Marley. Who? Uh, the singer. How do you handle fame? I am a fame by not being famous. Come on, you know you're a famous man. No, I mean, you know, not to me. Some people get drunk off your fame. See, I learned, I learned from, from <laughs> he was coming in. From I just started music. You know, the people I'm one, me. Them show me say, hey, this game is a game where if you don't mind sharp, you lose your consciousness. So, the only way you can lose your consciousness is because if you figure, say, you're, you're getting some people say, Ray, you might, your head might get swell. What do you think it is that has made Bob Marley such a big name? I think, you know, maybe it's just what Bob Marley stands for. What is that? The truth. And the determination to stay alive and survive. You know. You have a record out called Survival. Yeah. That was last year. Yeah. Was anything, did anything happen to you that caused you to write that? Well, 1976, I'm shoot off from the right. Yes. And I figured that was Survival. You know? Yeah. What happened when you were shot? You were in your home. Yeah. Was it in the morning or at night or what happened? Well, it was about um, well, that's about nine o'clock in the night. Yeah. What happened is that um, the night before, about three nights before that, I, I was living at a place called Pulby, you know, mm. and I went to about three o'clock in the morning and get a, and get some sleep, and then I vision I was in a lot of gunshot, you know, that was that was a, a dream. I was in a, a, a barrage, a gunshot, and but when when, when it all over, and it's like we never really get no shot. But we see my mother get shot. You know the vision show my mother get shot in her head. Where were you hit? Me. That's all. Yeah. Went right through, but just no. I said lies inside it. Yeah. Acceptable. What? Best album ever made. You don't recognize that. <clears throat> wow. He had this idea, it was kind of a virologist's idea. Um, he believed that you could cure racism and hate, literally cure it, by injecting music and love into people's lives. One day he was scheduled to perform at a peace rally. A gunman came to his house and shot him down. Two days later, he walked out on that stage and sang. Somebody asked him why. He said, the people who are trying to make this world worse are not taking a day off. How can I light up the darkness? You never saw the gun. Uh, at that time. But you know who did it? Yeah, I know them. Were they caught? No, but I don't court the police. Mm. 
Is that a sin on it? Well, I haven't seen it. You have a record company now. Yeah. Why? Oh, you know, a long time we always have a record company. What we have now is a recording studio. When we go into the studio to work, it was a lot of hassle. I mean, we're a raster, you know? Some people don't want to rust in them studio. No, if you stop all of this, you have to make one. Because, you know what I mean? A man might say, no, you say, I'll sell us your God. Well, you know what I mean? Go and build your own studio. You know what I mean? So, all right, I'll sell us this God, I'm going to build a studio, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so, you know what I mean? I just said, go. It just, it's just them things come through sabotage and through pressure. If everything was nice, maybe we wouldn't have to build a studio. But, you know, it, it's just a tricky place. It's not everyone really have that human thing and feeling. Some people just are dealing with them, they have no what I'm dealing with. Mm.